What's up with y'all, gang, man? So, got all this stuff on the table. I don't know if y'all seen all this, too. But, yeah, I just got done cleaning the gun. Yeah, that, that looked bad. You got metal shavings and gunk everywhere. So, yeah, I just got done cleaning the gun. I cleaned it at 250 rounds, and then I cleaned it close to 1,000 rounds. So, it's a big difference from when it was only at 250. I only had to use one cloth, and this one had three cloths. It was starting to build up some gunk fast, but yeah so we just got done cleaning it but that's not what today is about so today we are actually going to install night sights on the on the uh, on the pistol so yeah that's what we about to get into y'all okay so first things first i got this little kit right here and they had a different one but i just got this one it was like 40 bucks it's a sight pusher so i don't have to hit the gun with a hammer and all that stuff so i don't actually know how to use it yet this is my first time using it so i'm gonna take the holla sign off real quick and we're gonna get started from there. I ain't really showing y'all too much because YouTube don't like you to show like like showing like you to show yourself modern uh um modern firearms on YouTube. They don't they don't like that so as of right now I'm just gonna show it while it's already disassembled and I'm just gonna you know show myself putting it on here but I'm not gonna show myself pushing the side off and doing those things, you know, because YouTube don't like that. So you know I'm not trying to get my channel striked or anything when we just getting started. So we got the plate off, pile of sound off. So my thing is, I don't know exactly how to set it up on here, but we'll learn together. So you gotta twist it up on there. And it came with these stickies. I just went ahead and put those on before the video started so I could save time. But so I'm assuming that the slide goes on something like this, right? It goes on like that. I don't know if y'all can see. It just sits in there like that. And then you go tighten this up, and you're actually gonna raise it up to the right spot, cause th that piece could slide. I'm gonna put it in there and show you what I'm talking about. You gotta put this guy through like this, and you gotta tighten it up. You gotta line it up with the block. So as you can see, it's gonna go something like that. You see how that's right there on the side, and you push it off, basically. Easy. Your boy Gunsmith Taz in this boy. So we gotta slide that on out like that. I gotta get this guy off. I gotta find the right tool for that. Oh, you're really supposed to twist this side. So as you twisting, it's pushing. It's moving it. Oh, it's the, it's the nice size because look at y'all. It turns green, but the light is white. It's heat. All right, now I gotta find the tool for the middle. It look good. officially installed the night sights now i gotta put my holla sign back on now, i don't know if it was even worth it but it was given to me as a christmas gift but to put the holla sign back on see my thing is though i'm gonna try and get this holla sign put on my 21 because this one has a red dot i'd rather have the green dot with the night sights you know that look way better yeah so we're about to go ahead and put this guy back on where is the Put the holla sign back on, you know, screw that guy in there. We got the holla sign tight, now we gotta do another extra half a turn. Okay, another extra half a turn. There we go. Now, it got the nice size on with the holla sign. Now, it's, oh, before I do any of that, I gotta put my oil on here, cause I just finished cleaning the gun. Just a, just a little bit of oil, cause I know it's like, they said Glock don't need that much oil. So I just put it on like the sliding parts though. Ain't like, nothing too crazy. Cause it's gonna oil itself once you know 
Like, I just get, like, go right here real fast. Go through the slide real fast. Nothing crazy. Nothing crazy. Like, all the parts that you see, like, wear on here. I, I oil the parts that look like it has wear on it. You know, just so it can be lubricated when it slides and stuff like that. And, like, any part where, like, you know, like, metal. Where it's going to be metal on metal. I lube, so. So, like, I'm going to go right here. I'm going to go right here. Real fast. Yeah, because you don't need to cake it up. It's bar I'm barely putting any on here. It's, like, not enough oil to where it can, like, look, like kink up kink up um, stuff like the lead and all the gunk. It's just to have oil on it, period, though. Just everything runs smoothly. Any of the sliding parts, you put oil on, like, a little bit right there. Just a little bit. Rub it on there. Assemble the gun back. Make sure everything worked properly. Night sights on. So you could like technically you could still use the night sights with the hollow sound being on there. So yeah man, that's the install for this video. Put the night sights on. Peace. And if you enjoyed that video, drop a like. Tell me what I did wrong. You know I'm still new to this. No, tell me what I did wrong. Tell me what you would have did. And let me know if this video helped you or, or not, you know. Uh, it's your boy TBG Vlogs, man. So it's going to be TBG Firearms and your boy is out. Peace. Mm -hmm.